everybody. It's BB again. We're at Woodland Woodlawn Cemetery in Gotha, Florida, where there are supposed to be 10 famous people buried here in the cemetery, throughout the cemetery. Here at the Woodlawn Cemetery. Let's see if we can find, see if we can find the 10 famous people. That are buried here. Yeah. Right now we're in section M according to your map, right? N. N. And what'd you say the N was for? The Catholic Garden. Yep. All right. All I know is the 10 people that are buried is like Tim Cruz, he's a baseball player, Mike Collier, baseball player, Sam Grenison, football player, David Lonesome, Dave Parrott, Fog Hat band member, uh, T. Vincent Quinn, a congressman, Teddy Randanzo, musician. Now, Bob Ross, which I do know because he's the one on PBS, the painter, mm -hmm. he's a, an artist, PBS artist. Guy Spienza, lead singer for Riot, James Wren, Zach Taylor, a baseball player, and Monty Weaver. And a lot of these were before our time, <laughs> except for the band members, but I don't know any of that type of music oh, stuff. So. All right, let's go see if we can uh, find, them. find them. All right, mind you still in the Catholic section. We happen to see these praying hands. This is nice too. Yeah. It's like a remembrance tree with some Stones. Stones written. And then uh, this gentleman's here. This is real nice here. Got his picture and everything. Jonathan Michael F E R R E R. We'll definitely have to see what happened here. But uh, as we search on yep. to these famous people, I mean, there's other people in here as well yeah, that sure. have stories. So, as we, yeah, as we uh, walk around here, you know, we get at home, we could just pull up the name and just see what happened to that yeah. gentleman back there. He looked pretty young. Yeah, he did. And stuff. All right, let's just go. And a lot of these plots here look like two-man plots, the old yeah, style. The old style. Yeah. All right, let's go and check it out on this beautiful day. Okay, everybody. Right now we're in the O section of the Memorial Park. It's a Memorial Park, not a cemetery. Right, and this is Jesus by the section. This is Jesus in the Temple Memorial. Okay, let's go see if we find Bob Ross because he's buried in, in this, this area here. In this section. And O. All right, we found Bob Ross. A lot of change there. A lot of paintings. Yep. And this is section 0537. And this was the PBS guy, the famous artist. Yeah, the famous painter. Yeah, yeah. He's it's funny because when I was a kid, I used to watch that station. I really could care less for him. And I loved him. Seems like he became more famous after he passed away, but. That's usually what happens. But anyway, it's right by where the Jesus is by the. Jesus in the temple. And then memorial, yeah, in the right here. Time. You can't miss it. There's a lot of stuff here dedicated to them. All right, let's see if we can find the other ones. And we, what we'd have learned is that this was built in the 20s. Yes. And this is called a memorial. It's not a cemetery, and the, it's a memorial park. That's why you don't see no headstones. That's why everyone has flat heads. Head, well, headstones, but they're flat in the ground. They're not up. Right. They're it's, not erected up. Correct, because this is a memorial, memorial. park. 
Yeah. So it's open to the public and everything. All right, let's see. One down and nine more to go. Oh boy. <laughs> Wish us luck. All right, and we're by the section M where the Holy Trinity Memorial is. All right, let's go check that out. Some more stuff here. Yeah. Now this is something we just found here. And it looks like a tree that either fell down or rotted away. And they carved a bird or an eagle up on top. Eagle. Yeah. Beautiful. And BB thought it was just part of the tree. Yeah, I was like, but cool. no, they someone carved that. It's probably standing on the top of the tree and they carved it yeah. from there. All right, let's continue. That's great. Yeah, let's continue. And we got the Miyazaki family. That's beautiful. Buried here. I love it when it has the pictures. And they got a beautiful scenery right by the lake. Yeah. Very beautiful. All right, let's hunt down. See if we can get our famous people. Okay. Nine more to go. Another reason I enjoy coming to cemeteries. If you come here and see weeds, please pull them. All righty, let's go. Graduate of the U.S. Naval Academy class of 1947. Wow. All right, we're by the Memorial Bell. And still no famous people yet. Nope. All right, let's keep searching. All right, we found Fog Hat. Lonesome Dave, Prevert. I guess he was the lead singer from the Fog Hat. Yeah. And of course, that's where the bell was. We didn't even know we were in the same section. Yeah. And the lake is right behind us. Yeah. But it doesn't have nothing written on his marker to let you know. Other than just the guitar yeah. and the record. But he's definitely in. What section is this again? This is S. S. Yeah. And it's right by. Uh, the lake there all right two down eight more to go oh boy let's do it i think the other ones are in the mausoleums though. Uh, we'll see we'll see all right, and this one here has nobody in it but they made themselves a chair but we're gonna go to the mausoleums yep. let's check it out and before you even come in here it says these stones are from the holy land oh wow wow Okay. I mean, I love coming to cemeteries. I guess that's what it is. I guess you put a yeah. thing in there, but this is beautiful. This is definitely beautiful. Definitely. And how it looks like it works is that this comes out and they put your urn in it and then they seal it. Plaque. Yeah, they seal it with the plaque. Mm -hmm. It's like someone got moved or something. Maybe. Yeah, I love the ones with the photos on it. It tells a lot about a person when you see it. Yeah, you see the ones up there. Now, a lot of these going down there, they have, they're open. And these are more cremations. Inside of a room. Here's another one, looks like, with their wedding dress. Very nice down here. Very beautiful and peaceful. All right, let's see if we can find uh, seven, eight more famous people to go. I mean, I don't want to say what it is, but it's, it, it's a book with many names stuck to it. So I wonder if these are people that their ashes were scattered. Could be. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and then this like would be a way to still remember them. Yeah, yeah. So people can come here and uh, remember them in the book. I hope that one says reserve, reserve. Yeah. So but maybe that's what it's for. Yep. All right. So we continue. Got dogs over here as well. Everything. This do ye in remembrance of me. And this is the Last Supper uh, monument. And it's got the name of all the left to right, the apostles. Bartholomew, James, Andrew, Judas, Peter, John, Thomas, James, Philip, Matthew, Thaddeus, and Simon. Very beautiful. 
All right, we're at the Life of Christ Mosaic. Right now, there's a funeral going on inside there, but we'll just stay away from the... We're not going to bombard on there. Huh? No, no. But we can go to that circle to see what yeah. that circle says, because there's supposed to be something. Let's check it out. All right, this is the Woodlawn Chartes Labyrinth. Ryan, how to walk the labyrinth is the only one path that differs from the maze and that there are no tricks as you follow the winding map to the center and back out again surrender to the journey with an open heart and mind three stages of the walk purgation cleansing and shedding illumination the center is the place where you allow yourself to receive guidance and then union begins to follow you to the path each time you walk the labyrinth you become healed and strengthened for you work in the world clean your mind and become aware that you're breathing all right okay. that's pretty interesting let's see mm -hmm. if it takes us there all right so beautiful up close all right we tried it it was pretty interesting you walk a lot all right let's see if we can find them other famous people and this is the inside of the place all right let's see on the sides all right and then this is baby land one of them yeah they have three of them and this section right here all children they have three different sections just for babies oh, okay and this is one of them all right and it's right behind where g is at the uh -huh. section yeah okay let's go yep. yep this is him g 131 james w zach taylor and he was a baseball player Died in 74, before our time. Yep. All right. So we, how many we found so far? Three? Three. Seven yeah. more to go. Not going to make it. <laughs> well, let's try. That's all we can do. All right. Tim Cruz. Section. What's this? S1274. All right. Right by the bell. From the fog hat man down there. Yeah, the on all right. The right side of the so we found four people out of ten. All right, let's continue. Okay, we drove through. You have to stay in the cemetery to get to Arbor Oak Estates, and this is a park. But on this side here, it's more glamorous, big, more elaborate. Yeah, and we noticed this from over there. That's what it is. The sun is shining through there. That's what it is. The shun, sun was shining through the, oh, the, glass. the glass. Yeah. Wow. wow. That's beautiful. Look at that. Family pictures and everything. So. All right. Yeah, and this got a river running through it and a fountain. All right, let's check it out. Yeah, as far as the famous people that we were... Rodney C. right there, Jones. We only found four of them. Yeah. One was cremated. He had a little plaque, which was a singer for Riot. That Sky Spaceri. Uh, we couldn't find that one, but. Wow. It wow. It's amazing. Oh, yeah, this one here is more definitely. And there's the little river. Flowing all the way down. Goes all the way down there. And this is the beginning area where it all starts the waterfall down. You could cross a bridge, I'm sure. When it fills up, they'll bury people in there. Mm. This is beautiful, dude. Yes, it is. Another one of many reasons why I like coming to cemeteries, too. It's like a BMW motorcycle. That's a big one too. 
Then you got all these little ones over here. Wood pitchers. Turnbull family. All right, anything you'd like to say as we're leaving? Well, it's been an adventure today. Yeah, very beautiful. I mean, that one's shaped like a Bible with names. You got the heart ones here with the roses on it and stuff. You got palm trees. Prayer arms. You see the one with the chest Oh, and there in the end, yep. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, this very... Definitely unique. Definitely. This is... This is why I love coming here. People think of new ideals all the time. Yeah. To remember their loved ones. And I love the picture ones. Yes. The I picture like ones one are definitely... When they were young and then when they were older and... Yeah. Still together. I mean, even looking at this one here. Yeah. She looked like she was a movie star or something. Beloved wife, mother, grandmother. Yep. Got one over here. Kaylee John Thomas Odgen. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 4 years old. But yeah, I mean, this definitely makes you reflect. Yeah, it does. On life. Because life is too short and it's not promised another tomorrow. Yep. I mean, it's like they said, you keep putting stuff off for tomorrow, that tomorrow's our biggest. It never come. Right. Tomorrow is our biggest enemy. I know so. I used to do that. And then after my son, I don't do that no more. Yep. So you got to live for today. Because tomorrow is not promised. It's not promised. It's your enemy. All right. Well, from the cemetery, we only found four people that were famous out of the ten. Yep. Which was pretty good. Uh, and we've seen a lot of, definitely a lot of headstones and, mm -hmm. and stuff to reflect on. Definitely. So reflect on life and till our next cemetery video. See y'all. <laughs> so no, it's not nothing exciting to some people, but I mean, I enjoy going through cemeteries. Yeah. I enjoy thinking about people who passed away, my friends, family, yep. anyone. This makes me think about all of them, even though they're not buried here in Florida. They might be buried in other states, other countries, but yep. hey, in my heart, they're all in Still one there. spot. Yes, yeah. Yep. Same thing with you, with your son, your family, dads, everything. We, we have them all in here. And if you haven't walked through a cemetery, then you need to. Yeah. They need do. to. And whether you believe in God or not, it doesn't matter. This is real. Death is real. And once we're born, that's one thing we're guaranteed. We're gonna yeah. die. Yeah, and this is a good place just to come and just think about everything. From your childhood to your family to to how your life is where you're at right now. Yeah, maybe how you wanna be yeah. taken care of at the end. Yeah, yeah. But uh it's amazing. All right, until the next video. See ya. Alrighty. And we leave you with this. If there ever comes a day when we can't be together, keep me in your heart. I'll stay there forever. We love you, our little froggy. <laughs> and, and I'm scared of frogs. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. But he likes that one. I can't jump on it.